Tips and tricks. Delete an existing account. Please note, by deleting an existing account, you will delete all information that has been entered into that account. Click on the Home tab and then click on the Delete an Account button below the Select an Account section. Click in the Select box for the accounts to be deleted and then click on the OK button. The deleted ticks box will show that the account has been deleted. If you wish to restore a deleted account, click in the select box for the account. Click in the restore deleted accounts tick box and then click on the OK button. Duplicate an account. You can quickly and easily create new accounts with the same columns by duplicating an account that you already have customised. Open the account you wish to duplicate from the home window. Click on the options icon. Click on duplicate account. Enter the name of the new account in the white box that appears. Click on save. A new account with the same column headings but no data will be created. Lock and unlock your records. Once you have completed your bank reconciliation for the month, your records will be locked. This is to protect you from accidental changes that will not only affect that month's reconciliation, but also any reconciliation you have completed for future months. The reconciled bank balance carries forward from month to month. Also, deposits and checks that were outstanding at the end of a month may have subsequently appeared on your bank statement and are no longer recognised as outstanding. Consequently, if you make a change to an earlier month, you can create yourself a disaster and have to complete your reconciliation again. Provided you have reconciled correctly, the only time you should need to make a change is when you've entered an amount into an incorrect column and you want to move it to another column. However, extreme care is required to ensure that you do not alter anything affecting your bank reconciliation. If you have already transferred information to your accountant, you should only make changes advised by your accountant. To unlock a month, you must first click on the Bank Reconciliation tab. Now click on the Unlock button. Your Money In and Money Out records will also be unlocked. You can now make the changes you wish. To lock it again after you have made your changes, process the bank reconciliation and click on the finish button. Rename an account or business file name. Click on the options icon. Click on rename account and business file. The current account name and current business file name will be displayed. Type the new name and click on Save.